All right, so today we are making a three inch, or actually a twin three inch exhaust for the Rodeo. So we're gonna convert all these 180 degree bends I've got into a nice twin system for this. So that's the little original, it's tiny. We're gonna run one outlet here and basically one there. And then we're gonna start running back under the car, try to get as far as I can now with the pipe that I've got. And eventually the whole system from dump pipe back will be three inch. So let's go. So the old exhaust is off. Um, what I'm gonna do is cut all these hangers off because I wanna reuse those. I'll pretty much just cut them off and see how they, like, they're pretty much underslung. So I'll cut them off, put them back in the car and actually hang the new exhaust on that as I build it. But just for a size difference. That's the original pipe there. That's two inch, gave it a measure. That's our new three inch pipe. hangers are back where they were so it's pretty much now start laying some pipe in there and making it happen really so i managed to find an old mount off an old exhaust outside so i'm pretty much just going to weld that up under there now before the hanger for this side's exit and then we still got this original side so here we go plan at the moment is I'm gonna start making the like this exit where it loops around to this exit get that up there and hang in and then I'll wire piece in to go down there so I'll just get this rear bit hanging so it's in see how it looks and then I'll pretty much made it into where the rest of the exhaust is gonna be
what I was working on there was the smudge piece. So cut the two bits in half, the two 90s, join it together, basically through there, split into the two and go out to each side. So I sort of changed my mind a bit, but now this is how we're gonna do it. So instead I was gonna run the tips out through here, one there, one there, where the original one was. But I reckon this way looks a lot cooler. And then we got our merge up here. And then that will go down the car. So we'll continue with that. I reckon that looks a lot cooler than how I was gonna do it before. All right, progress has been made. So we got our two exits there wire piece and now I've started coming over the diff going down to the car I'll show you from this way oh yep light wants to go flat so yeah that's our progress so far also for the clamps I'm using on this exhaust here I've got the v-bands so pretty much put a v-band on the end of that now and then I'll start the new section of pipe down there So I'm now down to about halfway under the car, just after the transfer case. So making good progress is the V-band. And as you can see that old hanger, it actually just worked. The pipe just sat in it, which is good. And go back there. And obviously I can't run a spare tire with this setup, but sacrifices you make for a cool exhaust. All right, update time. So all the way from the back, across, and up to this section that wraps around the transfer. As you can see there, I am going to weld that to that flange because as I said earlier, I had limited pipe, which I've now ran out and it is long weekend. So when I can buy more pipe, I'll finish the rest of my exhaust. But so far, this is what we've got. So I'll just finish off the hangers, which are up there. Just weld them on, weld out the exhaust, and that'll be it for now. So exhaust is now done. So it's back in the car, all welded up. So, yeah, and as we get to here, I've got 
dodgy join, but they'll get me through the list long weekend, and then we'll finish off all this bit up to the turbo. But I probably won't do that bit until I actually change the turbo, because an upgrade is coming. So the twin dump exhaust for the little Rodeo is done. So as you can see, one outlet there, one there. So now we'll just do a few sound clips and show you what it's like. <laughs> 